Hi, I'm Dr. Jim Fazone, Superintendent of Schools in the Mercer County Special Services School District. I'm here with Susan Fisher, and we told you a few weeks ago we were going to report back on the Mercer Friends, our new program, where we give food to many of the students that are here. It's also part of our transition program. Susan, welcome to the Superintendent's Corner again. Hi. <laughs> Tell us a little bit about the transition program and the Mercer Friends. So Mercer Friends is up and running. We have a class here right now working with our therapists and teachers to assemble the bags. If you look around, you can see that everybody has a job and everybody um, is working hard to fill each of the plastic bags we have here. And um, the end product is right here. Josh, you want to come over? Oh, we have one? Okay, here we and go. And here's the end product. This is Josh. Josh has the end product right here. What's in the bag? Stuff. There, okay, so stuff is in the bag. Breakfast. Breakfast? What else? Milk. Milk? Okay, what else? Anything else? There's oatmeal in there. And there's oatmeal? Yes. And what else? Oh, you forgot. Okay, well, thank you. The this story of our show, bag. Josh, yeah. who has now the uh, showing us what's in the bag, and he is correct. That's everything that's in the bag. And these bags will go to whom? They'll go to our families that signed up to receive a bag every other week. Thank you, Josh. Our families um, that returned the interest form receive a bag every other Friday. So we're going to walk around the room. We're going to talk to some of the folks that are here. You're going to see our program in action. Uh, and we hope you enjoy this uh, little trip to the Mercer Friends here in the Superintendent's Corner. We're back here in the assembly line. I'm here with Sheila. She's an occupational therapist. And Sheila, tell us what's going on right here in front of us as we see. But right now we are working on an assembly line. The kids are working on the skills they need to have to work together as a team to put together the bags um, to be distributed to the school and the other students. Um, so we're working collaboratively with the teacher and speech therapy um, to work on getting the bags filled. And what are we putting in right now? We're, we have... Uh, SpaghettiOs. Spaghetti SpaghettiOs and beef. Okay, very good. I just want to see what, uh, what was on the menu. Uh, and you can see this is how the program works. Uh, we do this uh, every two weeks. Uh, anything else, Sheila? Um, this is a great opportunity for our kids to um, get a chance to work with uh, the community to be able to you know work on skills that they're going to need post-graduation um, to be successful and to actually see their product at the end and see what they're doing and see how it gets distributed and and, and who's my man right here working the SpaghettiOs? This is Kevin. Hey Kevin. Hey. Wave to the camera Kevin. He's too busy he's working. Busy. He, he this is great. Wave? He, he, he's too busy working. He's, very he's a focused, humble guy. Which is great. Wait. Thank you, Kevin. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so take care. Thanks, Kevin. Again, Dr. Fazone here. I'm here with Barb. She's a speech therapist. Barb, tell us about uh, speech therapy and uh, your piece of the action here in uh, our assembly line that we have going here today at the Mercer Friends. Well, this is a great activity because the students get to follow directions. They get to talk to each other, um, communicate if there's a problem, if they need help. Um, also talk to each other about what goes into the bag next. Okay, very good. And uh, how do you find the program working so far? Oh, this is great. It, the students really have sustained their work. They're able to work now for two periods straight, um, filling the bags and seeing their completed work. Robin, tell us uh, what goes on each and every day uh, in the Mercer Friends when, when you folks come over here. Okay, so it's great because I have my therapist with me um, when we are doing our vocational training and so we're utilizing everybody and working on you know them speaking up for themselves continuing to work without without a break um, asking questions there's enough people to help with everything and ask questions if they need it and just working cooperatively but they've been working really hard all year and they, they're able to work for a double period, which is great, without any breaks. Once again, we thank you for joining us in the Superintendent's Corner. This week's episode was the Mercer Friends. I want to thank Susan Fisher and all of her staff at Mercer County Special Services School District. Uh, for Nick Sikowski, for Susan Fisher, and everyone here at Mercer County Special Services, we'll see you next week in the Superintendent's Corner. Bye-bye. Mercer High!